Lazulis Castle, Count Argonon's abode. The wedding was but one month away, and the whole castle was filled with excitement and anticipation. After all, the great houses of Argonon and Rambolt were to be joined in holy matrimony. Such a momentous occasion was the focus of the entire empire. Wow, would you look at that? Well, I'll tell you, this Argonon chap is no slouch. Seren, stop gawping like an idiot. The ball is due to start soon. There could be feuding nobles together in the same place. So take care that nothing unfortunate happens. Sure thing. Seren, try not to show off your complete lack of class, eh? Shut your pie hole! You're a fine one to talk. A knight. What's up? I was just thinking. I've got a long way to go. Ah, oh, you mean the knights? They're in a different league to us. People may fear us mercenaries, but they look down on us too. I'll join them. Someday. <laughs> dream on, mate. It's no dream. Follow me and I swear I'll make knights out of all of you. I know you will. I need to sort out a few things here before the ball. You can go take a look around. Knowing the layout of the castle might come in handy. Oh yeah, if you want to go back, show this to the guard at the gate. How did the ruler of one little island end up with a castle as grand as this? He's got to be hiding something. Can you tell me what... Can you tell me what colour dress Lady Callista will be wearing? I'm sorry, my lady. I do not know. You don't? Not ready yet. Please refrain from entering this room. This is such a beautiful collection. I wish I could read every one. I doubt they'd lend any to a mercenary, though. Mm, what now? The book's still out on loan, and I can't find a copy for sale anywhere. Doesn't anybody have a copy of The Art of Magic?
They keep such elegant maids in this castle. Your hair is all pretty too. Oh, stop it. <laughs> You'll make me blush. They keep such elegant. I last saw Lady. I last saw Lady Callista when she was a mere slip of a girl. I'm sure she must have grown into a fine young woman. I can't wait to see her. I own a ship. I own a ship. Quite natural, considering my status as an import trader. Why don't you accompany me? Spending dusk on a boat is particularly enjoyable. You do talk about... Is that one of your friends bellowing in the courtyard? Can't you do something? I can't leave my post! Are you starting, mate? You want to say that to my face? Come on, then! Say it again if you're hard enough! the way you said mercenary just now. And? That is what you are, is it not? I'm saying I can't stand your holier-than-thou attitude! Your delightful manners are just what one would expect from a mercenary. Oh, you really want your ass kicked, don't you? Then bring it! Stay your blade. General Astar. You want some as well, you old git? Lady Mercenary, I apologize to you for my pupil's behavior. However, this is causing quite a spectacle. So would you humor me and leave your weapon sheathed? Sure, whatever. You've killed the mood now anyway. And... I've got better things to do. A minor crisis averted? This day is a joyous one. We ought to enjoy it. Sir Therius, what were you thinking? No one would believe you were a knight if they saw you behave in such a manner. General. The public expects us to act with decorum at all times. To betray that trust is a great dishonor. My sincere apologies. <laughs> Raise your head, Therese. No need to look so depressed. My apologies, General. <laughs> you know, I just paid a visit to the castle barracks. I see. Your thoughts, General. Lazarus Island is too peaceful. The result? Knights who forget their swords. They think not of their duty, but only of themselves. I agree, General. The knights I see here are totally devoid of aspirations. Indeed, the mercenary we just met seemed much more adept as a swordsman. Quite. Therius. 
I am thinking of training another knight here. You wish to take on a new pupil? <laughs> Is that worry I hear? Fear not. I doubt anyone could surpass you. Therius, I feel that the cloying peace of this island hides something darker. If there is anywhere that requires honorable knights, is it not this island? Agreed. With each day that goes by, more pain is caused throughout the Empire by the land's decay. And this island is a key location. So having a knight here who the people can trust could ensure peace throughout the entire Empire. Indeed. So Therius, when that time comes, you must work together with that person. Yes, General. It will be as you wish. Therius, it's just you and me. No need to be so formal. As you command. Therius, I just said not to... No. Oh, no wonder you're not a hit with the ladies. The city's nice enough, but the castle's filled with some right creeps. Barbaric woman, raising her voice in the castle like that. That uncouth woman raised her hand to that knight. How she faltered when she saw General Astar's magnificent form. What's the matter? Are you lost? This is my first time here as well. Sometimes I get lost. Hey, Therius. General, I'm sure one of the servants would guide you if you asked. And make me look like a fool? Certainly not. So you see, if you're seeking a guide, you might wish to look elsewhere. The Wren's flashed her fangs, eh? She excels at making trouble. By the way, I think Dagron's all done with the preparations. He should still be on the second floor, near the top of the stairs. How did the ruler of one little island end up with a castle? We finished sorting out the details. Are you ready, Zael? Right. Time for work. Don't let me down. Lady Callista's engagement was to be celebrated with an extravagant ball. Nobles and aristocrats gathered from all over, not wishing to miss such an occasion.